Okay guys, so today's video is an indoor archery video. Here's our panel, we got BMAC, still working on the computer, getting our website set up for uh, some goods as you see here. We'll explain those later. We've got Isaac from Easton, Gordon from Mountain Ops. So pretty rare that you get all of us together at one location at one time, but it happened to work for a lunch break today. We're gonna shoot our bows because we will be headed to Texas soon to hunt Axis deer. And it's been a minute since I've shot, so I'm shooting my old bow. I haven't got my RX-3 set up yet, so we're going back to the old Pro Defiant. So the plan was to start at 20. That's why lane 13 and 12 were set up for 20, but Isaac says, come on, man, just shoot 77. 77 yards. Total focus. Low. Low left? Low left. Sounded smooth. Man, I haven't shot for so long. I'm just gonna have to put all my trust in my slider. This has been forever. You're in the red. I'm in the red? Barely in the red. Not bad, first shot in months, literally in months, at 77. Here's Jordan, let's see. With his FOC arrow. With all the fog. I don't have a pin for it. I don't know how those work. But. So I have this set out to 60 yards. Mm -hmm. So I can't anywhere from zero to 60. This thing will just, that dot. Doesn't matter if it's 66, 63, 55, 45, wherever, it's just gonna put that dot exactly where it needs to be. If that dot doesn't show up, I don't have it sighted in. Oh, so, so I'm sad, he's yeah. out. So that's what tech gets you sometimes, dude. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty impressed with that shot being the first out of the... When was the last time you shot? Dude, last fall. Okay, so here's my philosophy on this. Now that you shot this, mm -hmm. you're gonna go to 20, and watch the difference. It, you're you're to be more comfortable, you're gonna hold steady. And just nail it? Start nailing it. Okay. Okay, at 70, but not I tell you, I've been doing my mountain ops, bro. <laughs> he's, been, he's been going to the gym. <laughs> I started Look at going this guy, he's lost 15 pounds. 15 pounds. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go to 20 and just get started and, and see how we do it. 20, 30, 40, I think that's gonna be most important because axis deer hunting it should be somewhere within that range. So let's get everybody out there and see what we can do. All right, so my first pin on my setup, this black gold sight, is actually 30. I'm gonna aim dead on and I should hit three to four inches high at 20. <laughs> Yeah, perfect. Twelve o'clock. About three. I'm not kidding. This bow is a slayer. I already have confidence. It's only one shot at twenty. Do this other orange dot on the same black one. Get Junior. First shot out of the sliver. <laughs> Where is it? Bullseye. 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 I'm just gonna let him hang. It's kind of like a Kobe. Like when you shoot that three, yeah. and you just hold that. You got style, man. Just form. Dude, it's Dang, all. Dang, dude. In the yellow. That's what happens when you like, I don't know, work out. Jeez. That was a nice shot, man. No, I didn't. My groups. Right there. I think it was smashed inside the box, or inside the uh, bow case. So leaning to the right a little bit. Stack it. <laughs> Lexi, 77 yards. This is the best part of having kids. Son, will you pull my arrows for me? Paper, paper, just barely. 20 off. yards, dude, go on. See, that's my 30, uh, 30 yard pin. I figured it'd be about that distance, but full, dead center. Full click and you're, you're cutting paper. Here's where you need the, the arrow grip. Yeah, pull your skittles out. Freaking disco inferno over there. Yeah, guys, so we have new hush veins and wraps, and with the ones that we offer, you can build yourself 
the uh, Skittle arrows. So let's go show them to you real quick. So these are the AAE Hybrid 26s. We've got them coming in six different color options. Fluorescent yellow, fire red, white, bright green, neon orange, bright pink. You get uh, 40 veins in one pack. I think they turned out really good. We've been shooting these now for, oh man, I don't know, six months probably trying them out. And so far they've been awesome. And then to accompany your veins, you can also get these custom wraps. Here's kind of how the artwork looks. These are uh, four inches long by one inch wide. So they should fit on any diameter arrow. They, if you were shooting like a thinner diameter, like arrow sh uh, Eric and Martin are shooting, you'll have just a slight little overlap, but it shouldn't make a difference. If you guys want Skittle arrows, Taste the Rainbow, Disco Inferno, you'll have to buy, <laughs> you'll have to buy a lot of colors. Low, low left, but number nine. I love the lights. Yeah, those lighted knocks are sweet. I think that was good. I'm here. Access to your house in Texas. With this guy. It's coming up quick. It's coming up way quick. Better get dialed in. What, next week? Yep. 30 yards. Dude, you're too long. Tough, man. That was freaking tough as well. Dude, these. Are you moving to Bozeman, bro? Squeaky because the parking lot was wet. Did you forget your white claw? Dude, I got one in my pocket for later. <laughs> when you know he's from Southern Utah. Dude, this is not Southern Utah. This is like retired old man. Comfort from Southern before, Utah. Comfort before fashion. How you doing, brother? Where'd you come from? I was at uh, Crispy. Oh, nice. Shooting 30 yards now, which is my top pin. We are so with this sight, you got my slider. I've got them dialed in for 30, 40, 50. Anything after 50, you just dial. So at this distance, top pin should be dead on. I did a four shot group at 30. I swear I like basically surrounded the whole thing. A couple of them I pulled left for sure. There might be one on paper, but we'll have to wait to go check it out. Well, not as uh, not tight a group as 20, but two of them on paper at 30. What's your idea? As I can see Isaac is thinking over there. Nah, I'm off in my own little world right now. You're thinking, thinking you know. about Wu-Tang, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, I got my hand. came out Showtime. <laughs> hey, they have a new. And did you know that Ghostface Killer has two special needs brothers? No, I did not. Do you know how we found out? How? Melissa's doctor. He found out that <laughs> I like guys. this thing. Okay. So the, what's your name from? Uh, Loophole. Riz? Riz. I always tell her, going, hey, so you parents Wu Tang fans? <laughs> She's like, no, his name's different. She even knew what I was talking about. <laughs> told you guys. I know, I know what's in that, going on in that guy's mind, as weird as it may sound. It's always Wu Tang. All right, guys, we got to see if Martin can shoot his bow. Okay, so Martin has to follow the same rules we did. He has to get his bow and shoot at 77 <laughs> for shot number one. But then wait, we'll put him at 30. Martin hunts the Wasatch, so 77 should be pff, a piece of cake. Piece of cake, right? That's where his zero's at. Because that's, <laughs> that's where his average that's, yeah. that's his top pin. You got to go 77 yards. Yeah. Oh, the single so pin, huh? Times like this is when you want to bring your spotting scope with the phone scope on it so everyone could just watch. I know, I wish I'd brought mine. Hi. Left to the blue, in the blue. 
This is what I, wait, was the last time you shot your bow? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fall. This is what I loved about it. When you drew back, <laughs> look at all the leaves that fell. <laughs> <laughs> that's from yesterday. Okay, I went on a hike. Okay, I was like, you, yeah. you took your bow on a hike? Those said, are green, yeah. You took your bow on a hike? Yeah, I went turkey hunting yesterday. Okay, I took last your bow night. on a hike. Yeah, but I, I didn't get one. I so. do that a lot too. <laughs> I take my bow but, on a hike. Yeah, the last time yeah, I shot was in, fall, so. Okay, what do you so think of these guys that? that don't shoot their bow through the whole the all year round? See, like I think it's pretty common, to be honest with you. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, I think it's really common. Red, high, high in the red. Heck, we're all Not on bad. target at least. Yeah, I thought I was <laughs> busting arrow. Isaac is uh, pretty dang good at making tribute videos yes. for all his friends. If anybody gets a tribute video, pretty big deal. It's kind of like like we say like when you get made fun of by your friends that's actually how they're saying they like you so if you can't handle it then you probably aren't gonna last in the friendship very long this guy likes to send it like full send he makes a full production video like just mocking you but it's because he loves you here's the Casey trip Casey, Casey this is video. the most recent one so oh, I haven't seen this one why do I think you're rocking the man bun yes why so what's the latest gun you just bought Christians in arms <laughs> what caliber <sighs> Well, I wanted a 6.5 PRC, but they only have a 6.5 feet more. Exactly. Need I say more? I've got a 338 Lapua coming next week. <laughs> These are 30? Yeah, Mark, you think you can hit 30? Oh, yeah. Center punch, dude. dude. Center punch. Yeah, he's got that. Dead buck. 90 pound limbs. Freaking 95 pound limbs. Boom, Broke stacking. Arrow, dude. Stacking. <laughs> Chang's all right. Look at that. Freaking One perfection, click up. man. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. Stacks on stacks on stacks. Nice shooting. When you're shooting 95 pound limbs, Martin, <laughs> it's gonna bury it for a little bit. Okay, wait, hold on a minute. So we're doing, we're doing a right hand versus left hand shootout, and the rules are: if you hit paper, it's a point. Okay, but if you have the tightest group, it's three points. Three points for tightest group. So that way, someone could actually, it could be a tie. Yeah, because you can miss all of the paper but have the tightest group. Yep, and, and you, still win. You could win. It's like doing hunter's education. Exactly. When they tell you to shoot <laughs> yeah, the little it just squirrel. Has to be a group. Doesn't matter yeah, it's like, oh, we don't have to like hit the squirrel. No, you just have to hit the target. Not paper. Close Not at all. Okay, so just follow that arrow. <laughs> yeah, same high left. Ooh, okay. Consistency, same spot as last time. Ooh, Got some that's... George straight on the radio. Yeah, bro. Oh, I jerked oh, it. You, you, yeah. I got antsy. Ooh. Absolute Paper. focus. Paper. Absolute Did focus. Did you see the finger, trigger oh. finger? Did you see that? Yeah, I, dude, I took note. Oh. Okay. Yeah, when I a when foot low. Back, what I, happened there? I can just see that. I was like, he's gonna shoot way low. I know. I didn't mean to shoot that low. Yeah, that's kind of what we all just say. Happened. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. All right. When the pressure was on, I just crumbled. Dude. <laughs> My first first group was like that. Whoa, so it takes papers. a competition to get Dude. Eric to hit paper every time? Two points. Two points. One. Oh, another one, so that's a four point. Best group, three and points. Group. Six seven, points. Seven, one. seven points. I don't know what it is. Crooked. Look, it's kind of angled wrong. Oh, no wonder. Oh, I yeah, that makes so... <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> Just keep racking them up, dude. Me and not, Jordan not when it's seven Left, to one. Lefties united. Left, lefties Left, ununited. Lefties right ununited temporarily, <laughs> but will always be united. You hit black dot, you get two points. You hit paper, you get one point. Tightest group, regardless, gets three, three points. points. I'm actually not feeling as confident as I should after watching what he just did to Martin. That was a massacre. <laughs> Paper, three o'clock. I think you're that touching could be paper. Maybe. That yeah, might be paper. Think... Looks like I'm south. Low. Six low. Shoot. Good. Paper. Dude, For sure. I'm in trouble, guys. That was the arrow in the coffin, if you know what I mean. I am in trouble. Ah. 
That was like that such a weird release, but I actually hit, think I hit paper on it. I don't think it's gonna be hard for you to judge. <laughs> Game Too over, dude. Totally. Eric, bro. That's a clean sweep. That must, that's what Golden State feels like when they destroyed Portland. Man. Bro is on like Don Kong and he almost even got an extra two. So he got the three plus the three. Six. I got maybe judge. Wait, 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 wait. Am I zero? Oh, dude, you're barely out. <laughs> Sorry. You're not even gonna Dude. give me that? Can camera? Look at this. At least, That's at least like, Martin got one. You could see the oh. foam underneath the I'm the, I'm the absolute you could see worst. It. Yeah, you, Look you at this. This it. is the worst consistency. At least I know I'm in the right line, but I can't freaking bring it up. Yeah, I'm grouping and it, and it's vertically. Foam. It's foam. Remember that. I'm vertically challenged, guys. All right, guys, we're gonna wrap up this video. Just another fun day shooting with all our friends. Yeah, Random yeah. guest shed crazy came out of nowhere. I, I swear he's stopped. By the way, I didn't, oh, I didn't stop. Stop. attack him. <laughs> you Anyways, we're gonna wrap it up, but we have something to tell you about the event that's going to be June 21st, 22nd, Is it here? 23rd. Here at the Easton Archery Center in Salt Lake City, we're having an Easton Bull Hunter Block Party. What is it's gonna be a gear swap? 3D shoot, we're gonna have vendors here. It's gonna be a good time. Uh, Friday night is gonna be the gear swap. Come on down, bring all your old hunting gear and it's like a swap meet for people. And then we're gonna have a glow and arrow shoot here that, that evening. But then Saturday, Sunday, we got 3D courses set up here at the Eastern Archery Center. So come check it out. Visit uh, easternarchery.com backslash bowhunter block party for all the info. All right guys, we'll put a link to the uh, bowhunter block party in the description box. But we're gonna continue shooting. These guys are continuing to just talk. It's important. These guys are tired. Well, my my uh, ego has been crushed today, <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just trying to recover right now. After Eric just massacred both me and Martin. Well done to you, sir. As anyways, thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. And uh, coming up soon is going to be Axis deer hunting videos with these guys in Tejas. Peace out, guys.